don't want to be on TV. Scribble, scrabble. Just write my name in graffiti. Today I'm going to show you how to create your own subway art using Photoshop. But before we begin, you will need a few things. Photoshop. I am using Photoshop CS5 in this video. 2. Fun fonts. Your computer already comes with a variety of fonts, but they may not be the most exciting. Go to a free font website like thefont.com to download some. The fonts I am using in this video are Sketch Rockwell, Abraham Lincoln, Duke, Gear Slab, Lavandrea, Avril, Ribbon. 3. Creativity. This is art, so have fun! First, go to File, New. Make sure your preset is set to US Paper and your size is letter. Note the height and width in case you want to print it. Select OK. Next you want to go to the View tab and find rulers. This will show you the rulers in inches. Go to the Rectangular Marquee tool, select it, and then find about an inch margin on each side. This can take some time. When you're ready, simply click, draw, and release. You might want to hit the marquee tool again just to make the lines disappear. Next, go to the paint bucket tool, which may be hidden by the grant tool. Go to foreground color. This will take you to the color picker. As you see, you'll have many colors to pick from, so pick your favorite. I'm going to type in the number box, my favorite. Select OK. Now simply click within the square you drew. Go back to the marquee tool and again click to remove. Next, go to the type tool. Make sure it's horizontal and go to foreground color again. Select white, or in the number box, 6F. Select OK. Now you simply click within the box that you colored and type. You can adjust type by adjusting the size, or you can go to the move tool and adjust that. Another way to transform your text is to hit Control and T on a Windows or Command and T on a Mac. Continue to type as many words as you want and many different uh, types of fonts. When you're finished with your type, go to File, Save As, pick the designated area you want to save in, choose your format as a PNG. This is best for images like this. Name it and click Save. And that's how you do it. That's how you make subway art. Now you can choose one color like we did here, or you can choose multiple colors. But whatever you do, make sure they're complementary, but have fun with it.